Israel. That's right. Right? And mainly his first fruits, the elect. Right? And, and because of that, he was able to open the seven seas, which is the mystery of this book. That's right. The mystery of the records, the history, our heritage, and our nationality. And the prophecies that for what is about to happen, which I have to daily. Right? Because the scripture says like a woman in travail should have birth pains or birth pangs. Right? What is that? When a woman pregnant or she's about to give birth, then right, she'll have contractions. In the beginning, it's going to be far few. And coming down to the delivery, it's going to be closer. And then what we see it, right? Go ahead. Right? Verse 12, teach us that the night of holiness and worldly love, you shall let sober. Right, so this is this is this is the grace. Grace as, as, as a brother Yahweh, he is breaking out too. The word charis, which means to what to, to be favorable. Right. What what did most high gave us? To be favorable in his sight. His law such as a commandment. We are alone in the nation of Israel. We are alone receive that. Right? That's the grace. And now we in the time of liberty. The liberty of that grace. Bring it back into the remembrance. The law such as a commandment. The righteousness of the most high. That's something. Yeah. This is Isaiah 58 and 1. Cry aloud, spare not. Lift up thy voice like a trumpet and show my people their transgressions and the house of Jacob their sins. Yes, yeah, show my people their transgressions and the house of Jacob their sins. Right? But you have, you have to be reformed in order to have the authority to do so. Right? You have to be reformed yourself because you should say, I don't confidence and don't add light unto the Gentiles. That way you're supposed to eat the roll. And after eating the roll, which is getting me 100% of the truth, then they come out and teach. You don't come out here half heartedly. Right? Um, go back to your. To have a comment. Somebody bring up a comment on the boat holding firm. Why? Yeah, it's a Rakatha. Yeah, how about Shemi Awashai? Yeah, how about Shemi Awashai? Yeah, you have a precept. Hebrews 3 and 6. Hebrews 3 and 6, anybody? Hebrews 3 and 6. No, no, oh, so like, no, that's, yeah, that's his name. That's his name. That, that is part of his title, right? So the Bible Titus, Papa Pasha. Titus, um, two, right? So as it says, and worldly love, we shall live soberly, righteously and godly in this present world. Right, we're supposed to live soberly, righteously and godly, that's what the law such as a command also commandments will have us living in that way. Right? That's what makes us different from these beasts out here. Right? From these grimy ass niggas out here. From yeah. these creatures, these heathens. Yeah. Right? Where? It says, looking for that blessed hope and the glorious appearing of the great um, Yahweh and our Savior, Yahweh Shai, Hamashiach. Right? We're looking for it. Our hope is to get out of this place. For this place to be destroyed. Right? To be cleansed. To be purified. And, That's right. And, and the kingdom of heaven will come in. Right. Wait, but, but, and that will only happen if, if it is destroyed, if the Hawashai, when the Hawashai comes, right? Go ahead, how about that precept? In 2 Peter chapter 3 and verse, then it says, it says, seeing then that all these things shall be dissolved, what manner of person are ye to be in all holy conversation and holiness? Right, so you're supposed to consider your ways. Consider your ways. The scripture just described how we should be sober in one manner of righteousness. Consider your ways. Man. You understand? The scripture says, Examine thyself to see if ye be in the faith. That's what it is about self examination. The scripture said that, hey, well, as long as we come to serve you, Lord, prepare thyself for temptation. So you don't just get the word and everything is okay. You're not in the kingdom. We all jolly, merry, and all make happy nation. We're going gonna, we're gonna to build soup kitchens and, 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 and garment factories and schools. No, we need help. The curses still apply until the Yahweh Shai comes to deliver us out of it. And our enemies in hell, they're, gonna, they're about to come down hard and heavy on us. Right? Finish it off there, Laman. I have something to bring to you real quick. This is our second Timothy 3, 16, 17. Okay. All scripture is given by inspiration of the Most High Yahweh and its prophets of our production for reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness. That the man of the Most High power may be perfect furnished unto all good works. Right, so that's all weapons right there. All the scriptures is our weapon. It's our shield, it's our buckler. When pursuing the Ezekiel and Ephesians. Right? Ephesians chapter 6. Right? The, the, the scriptures, the word, 
is for exhortation, for reproof, for doctrine, for correction, for lifting up. Right? Even for break, even for breaking down. Because it's gonna break down the wicked way that was in you, the old nigga. Right? And when the apostle, the apostle Paul said, uh, when he basically, he basically he goes back to the law to find the thing going off. Right? In Romans um, 7. Right? Going on to, I believe, was um, was 16 somewhere around there. Uh, right? He goes back to the law. Right? To, to, to witnesses of a, a precept here to Malachi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all. Yeah. Where's that? This is 2 Corinthians 5 and 10. For we must all appear before the judgment seat of Mashiach that everyone may receive the things done in his body according to that he had done, whether it be good or bad. Right, and Revelation chapter 22 echoes that. Right, Yahweh Shai himself said, Behold, I come quickly, to, uh, and, and my reward is with me to, to render heaven to every man what he had done, good or evil. Done. Good or bad. Right. right? So when you understand of repentance, it's, it, it, it is wise. As the, as the apostles and the uh, elements as I say, it will behoove you to repent, right? And not to lower the law of Yahweh Shai, right? And right now we see that movement or a perverse spirit pushing upon the earth. When these people just did it, they just rejecting the Lord's law, the Lord's law. You understand? But it's, it's, it's good. It's good. It's to their judgment, to their condemnation, and uh, it, will, it, will, it will ultimately cause some form of purification to come to this place. One of three. The fire, the pestilence, or the wind, the, the missiles. So Isaiah chapter 19 and verse 14, right? And it reads, um, Yahweh Shem Yoshai had mingled a perverse spirit in the midst thereof, and they have, and they have caused Egypt to err in every word thereof, as a drunken man staggered in his vomit. Right, so yeah, the same thing you're saying for God's spirit, right, and it caused them to err. And why these, these people seem like they, they, they're not reverencing the most high, right, but that is the most high raised them up, right, that you fall in and show them once more. Um, what is he saying, um, in John, John 12, 28, I believe, it says you cannot glorify thy name. He said he had glorified it and he's going to glorify it again. That's right. All right. I'm okay. just one quick one for you. You'll break it down, um, Lamar. It says, Psalms 51, verse 12. Restore unto me the joy of thy salvation and up up uphold me with thy free spirit. Then will I teach transgressors thy way and sinners shall be converted unto thee. Right? right? right. So, yeah, you renew you in that spirit to be us. Alright, and when it says that the most high put back that spirit to tell us and teach us our way, we can go out now and say, hey, you know that wrong? Right? Don't do that. It's like the elders, the apostles are great millstone. They learn through experience, like why they can tell us certain things from experience. You know what experience means? Try out. X, X means how and experience means a try. Yeah, and that's what we're doing right about now. Right? We've been washed with this word. Right? The, the, the men who truly get baptized. Right? With, with that green water and fire. If these men come on this side, they get a lot of things that are going to Right? Right? We have been baptized with that green water. And we put it out here and we do it. Right? We do kill you people at the gate. Yes, some of you will, will hate us. But hey, you can from the seat have to be called Ben. Alright? Uh, just for the shut off here. Deliver me from blood guiltiness or power, the power of my salvation. And my tongue shall sing aloud of thy righteousness. It says Psalms 51 verse 14. Deliver me from blood guiltiness, O power. Thou power of my salvation. And my tongue shall sing aloud of thy righteousness. O Lord, open, my, open thou my lips, and my, and my mouth shall show forth thy praise. Yeah, that is what we're doing right about now. You show forth the praise of Yahweh. Well, I shall be all shame. Right? And not Jesus and not no Christ and not Jehovah. Because them ate the gods of the Bible. That's right. They were close, so they're young before the days come. Alright? Because the days come, go ahead, Salah. It says, For thou desirest not sacrifice, else would I give it. Thou delightest not in burnt offering. The sacrifices of the Lord are a broken spirit and a broken and contrite heart. Hey, and oh. guess what? That is all we have to give right now. Because he's so, so wicked, he take all livestock, all land from us. 
So we can't give all these sacrifices. Right? So the only thing we could do is come and make our body as a living sacrifice. The same way how Yahweh Shai, right? The true Son of God made himself a living sacrifice. Alright? It says, a broken and contrite heart, for forward thou will not despise. Yeah, because we've been broken. The most high I used the rod, his rod is what they stick to broke up, to break up. Because hey, that's what if it is, you have a son, right? And it's gonna do wrong. And you beat him. And guess what? The son yeah. comes to your daddy well I'm sorry and tears in your eyes to say he has forgiven that son. Alright, you'll forgive that son. Have a broken and a son, try that. Have a parable and not talk about your the son that got his took his inheritance and went out to that far land. Spend it on water. Right? And then he became a servant, and then he said it's better than go back to his own father, and then become a father, and a servant in his own father's house, and the father rejoiced to be repentant. You understand? And that's the nation of Israel. Right? Because we went off, we went into them who them. We were supporting them other boys, them, 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 um, them idols. But now we come back, right? In this time, in this time of um, liberty, right? To the favor and uh, uh, to the grace of the Most High. Right? God. We now come back to our heritage and our nationality. That way it says, seek it alone. Why um, may be found? Why may be found? But finish off uh, Titus 1, please. I want to uh, I think two other pieces of that. Titus 1, verse um, 14, 2. 2, two Salakia, verse 14. Who gave themselves for us that he might redeem us from all the iniquity and purify unto himself a peculiar people. Zeal, yes, of good works. Yeah, we see yes, of good works. Now, why in Ezekiel 9 and 4 it says, We sire and cry for all the abominations that be done thereof. One of the chief abominations being done in the land of children and Tobago right now is on homosexuality. Right? right? Okay. Just touching that. Go. Yeah, all that is part of prophecy, too. Right? Go ahead, huh? I'm a good one thing over here. Right? This is 2nd Ezra 8 and 56. 8 and 55. And therefore, ask the. Ask so, no more questions concerning the multitude of them that perish. Yeah, the, mo the angel told Ezra, hey, don't consider them. Fuck you fucking asking about them for? You understand? You can't love the, the Lord in heaven. The, the Lord's people more than him. He said, ask not no more. Right? However, they be judged, they be judged. Go ahead. For when they had taken liberty, they despised the Most High, taught scorn of his law, and forsook his ways. Yeah, you see these proud nigga bitches going out, going to university passing here. What are they doing? They're watching and they're scoping yeah. at they're scoping at the men of the Lord. Right? They're scoping up their nose. You see these not going out. What what is the school of this? You see? Yeah, the, the, the theology school. Yeah, these mad men. What are they talking about? Last week the man was bugging out because we sit to hell with Jesus Christ. Man, right? Jesus Christ. The scripture said one to them and uh, that uh, uh, you make a when when no man pursue it. Man. Right? Because if they had any form of intelligence and I wasn't just program program effeminate bitches, right? They would have stopped and asked a question and be edified. Right? We'd have bring all the knowledge, throw it out of you, because you could just say that you're gonna bring this thing back into your remembrance. Yes, there was one in you. But the reason why that can't happen is because you're not of the elect, you're not of the sheep fold. Yeah, which I said, my sheep hear my voice, and do other shepherd they was follow. That's right. right? So this ain't for everybody. That's right. This is not for everybody. Two thirds gonna be destroyed. Two thirds deserve to be destroyed. That's right. Two thirds was rejoicing down in town this, this, this morning, this afternoon. When they pass the judgment that buckery is legal. Well, I saw a, a sodomite, right? It's free to do what he has to do. It, 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 it's all consent, uh, con what? Consensual between adults, right? To, but, but in the eyes of the Most High, there's wickedness. Because you know, I, I don't even know the full blood that our lawyers is until the brother actually broke it down for me. The, the boundary law. Now, if that was against the law all the time, the show of a man's countenance tell what he is, right? He walk will sell him out, right? How come they never lock up anybody before for hey, the law? Hey, Salakia, they said somebody, uh, I, I think it was a. Uh, a university professor and she was she she some she high up in law at a university of the West Indies. She was saying she was I heard out of her own mouth. She said that it's an archaic law. But what did she just say? That's a boy um seeking the old ways, old parts. Son, right? Archaic means old, right? 
all parts of the part of righteous.